Hey y'all, it's Brady. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me. Um, if you are brand new here, we are a family of four. It is myself, my husband, and our six and three-year-old girls. And today's video is all about Vlogmas. We are gonna be talking stocking stuffers and particularly no junk stocking stuffers. So I do have a few fun little things and some treats. Um, so it's not necessarily no junk food but I tried really hard to find some items that were not just gonna be, you know, stepped on and broken on Christmas morning or thrown away within a week. Um, I really tried to make sure it was things they were going to use or consume, um, either consume it quickly or use it for a while. So if that's something that you are interested in, stay tuned for the rest of this video. Okay, so here's a look at my six-year-olds and I've got, you know, their Christmas presents there behind us. So we'll get into those in the next video. But, and then this is the pile for my three-year-old. She is three and a half and my six-year-old is also six and a half. So um, I try to think about things that they'll use and not just, like I said, get broken, thrown away or forgotten. And I'm actually really proud of myself because it looks like I only did four yeah, four little treats. So I'm I'm pretty proud of myself because I tend to go a little overboard sometimes on like the snack stuff and candy. I just like it all looks so cute. Um, so this is everything. And let's start with my six-year-old first. So I did get a pack of underwear. The Cat and Jack ones were on sale for like 25% off. And I actually really like their socks and underwear for little girls. And then I also got the Cat and Jack low cut socks. And I don't know if you can tell, but like they're really squishy and comfortable. They have these in like crew socks and everything too, um, but they hold up really well. And my girls wear um, different size socks, socks. So these all have an M on them, which I really like because it makes matching socks much easier. And then I'll show you her, uh, my three-year-old's has um, an S on the, theirs for the size small. So it's really easy to tell whose is whose. Now, when if they get to an age where they're in the same size socks, then I'll probably have to buy different brands or mark them somehow. Um, but for now, this is what's working and these Cat and Jack ones hold up really, really well. I am really, really pleasantly surprised by these. So I think these were on sale for $4.19 for a six pack when I got them, but I think they're normally $5.99. And then I think these were like $8.99, or in, but they were on sale. So I got a 10-pack of those and a six-pack of the socks. And then let's go up here real quick. So Play-Doh, 50 cents. You'll see more of that in another video with some of their gifts. But they are huge Play-Doh Play -Doh kids. So um, then this, this Mr. Bubble Foam Soap was actually a two-pack for about $5. And I just split the pack in, you know pulled them out individually. So this one is Marshmallow Scent, Shape, Sculpt, and Create. I thought that would be super fun. And I'm, you know, kind of relishing in the idea that my six-year-old, you know, is, is somewhat close to being out of this kind of stuff. So I also got her these bath drops. They, you know, color changing tablets. There's 60 in here and those were 378, I believe. Those were from Target, but they do have them at Walmart as well. Um, and then I got... Um, this was actually in the dollar spot, I think. Yeah, this was in the dollar spot at Target. So this whole puzzle is a 45 piece was only a dollar and I thought that's pretty cute. So I got her the fairy home magical forest. And then one of her treats, I got Reese's pieces in the little candy cane shape because I always like to have one that sticks out of the stocking. The Crest toothpaste. This is just the Disney princess ones. I, um, I actually looked at Target and Walmart. They both carry these and they have different characters on them. But this I actually got free. Um, and even if I hadn't had the coupon, it would have been cheaper at Kroger. So check your Kroger or Kroger affiliates when you're looking for things like this because they were three, over $3 at Target and Walmart for each one, but they were only $1.99 at Kroger. So 
um, you know, something to consider there. I did get the, their toothbrushes. We've never tried them using like the electric toothbrushes or battery operated toothbrushes, but I thought, you know, this might be fun and we're kind of at an age where that might be good to try. So this was $4.99. She got Ariel. I probably would have picked a different princess, but I got that on a shipped delivery order and um, unfortunately that shopper didn't do like sometimes they will and let me pick so but it's fine they like all the princesses it's going to get replaced in a couple of months anyways so it's not the end of the world and then uh this kids mix 20 flavor jelly belly jelly beans was a dollar they also had like a holiday mix but i got the kids one and that was from target this was also the target dollar spot and it was just a fun little furry headband, so I picked that up for them. This actually got at Aldi, but I know that they frequently have these in the Target dollar spot as well. Um, I paid $3.99 for this, and um, it was because our Target dollar spot had not been having them. So when I saw it at Aldi, I went on ahead and picked them up. And you can find these mess-free marker things. Um, you don't need water or anything. It's just like the, almost like the Crayola Color Wonder stuff. Um, it'll only mark on this paper. So anyways, I got that and, um, they both still really like those and it's good to have something like that in the car or, um, in my purse, you know, whatever, if we're doing something, which right now we're not really in and out doing much, but you know what I mean? Then I got her some more hair ties. This is the scrunchie brand. These were like $3 and I got the 50 count of the bigger ones in all the different colors so that'll be fun this was also in the target dollar spot oh those were from target but i think you can get them at walmart and kroger and stuff like that too um and heaven knows we can always use more of those <laughs> um and then i got this play pack um you know these are only a dollar as well they sell these at walmart and target i've also seen them at the dollar tree but it comes with stickers, a little coloring activity book, and three or four, three, four crowns. So, that'll be another good little thing to have on hand. This Star Wars Mandalorian Colortivity includes holographic stickers. So, those are pretty cool. Those were only a dollar in the dollar spot. So, I got one for her and one for my youngest. This is also in the dollar spot. One of these little learn to read books. I think this is a level three reader. Yeah, so she can read this on her own, I'm sure. Well, you know, for the most part. Um, but she may need a little bit of help. She is in first grade. And this one's all about our solar system, so I thought that would be cool. She really likes learning about that stuff. And then I did get this from Target as well. This is the North Pole Fluffy Stuff Cotton Candy in the Strawberry and Blue Raz flavor. That was a dollar, and her last little item is a treat as well. These were a dollar. I got the Hershey Kisses in the little tube so that it'll, you know, stick nicely in her stocking. So that is everything in my six-year-old stocking. Let's move on over to my three-year-old. It is pretty similar. Um, I don't know about you, but if you if you have girls close in age, which is probably why you're watching this, um, they want a lot of the same things and they fight over things. So it's almost better that they're almost the exact same items. I'm sure that that is going to change in the coming years, but for now, um, they like to have the same items. So she got cotton candy. She got the smaller hair ties. These were about $3 as well from Target, the 40 count. She also got a puzzle. It does say six and up, but um, and she may need a little bit of help doing it because it's 45 pieces but she can handle this. So, um, and the other thing that I forgot to tell y'all is if you can find these, they're actually in resealable bags. I don't know if you can see that there, that there's a zip, a zipper in there. So I really like that too, because that means, you know, it's something that already has a place for it to go. And then she really loves Reese cups, Reese's cups. Uh, so I got the miniatures, the nine count, nope, six count. There for her to stick in her stocking. She also got underwear. This is the Cat and Jack. You kind of see a pattern here. We really like the Cat and Jack stuff. She got the same socks, the size small. And again, like I was telling y'all, I don't know, you may not be able to see it here with the way these are packaged. There you go, there's the S on them. So makes it super simple. And then they know um, if, you know, I tell them to go get them out of the dryer or something like that, 
they know which one is theirs. And then, um, and like I said, I got these as well when they were on sale. This was a dollar. I showed y'all that. I showed you this. She got the same thing as my six-year-old. So the mess-free marker. They did have different patterns, but um, I just went ahead and got those the same. Hers, it, her toothpaste is the Frozen 2 Olaf. And they only had those two prints and they only had two of them. So that's why they're not the exact same. Jelly Belly Jelly Beans as well. The Reese's Pieces. And this, her foam soap, the Mr. Bubble foam soap, is sugar cookie scented. And then she also got some bath drops. I ordered these at the exact same time and they must be updating their packaging to that other one because they came in two different packages. Um, but I think they're, they're the same product. So she also got a headband. She also got a toothbrush. Hers is Belle, so she'll be excited. They love Disney princesses and anything pink and purple and all that good stuff. Um, she is really into Paw Patrol still, so I got her the Paw Patrol play pack. Same thing, the crayons, the stickers, and the little coloring book. And these play packs, if you've never seen them before, they are resealable as well, so that's good. I got her little, it's a level two reader, so obviously she can't read this, um, but, you know, she'll like it. So this one is all about puppies. So again, dollar spot, she'll love that. Um, whatever that's actually called now, I keep saying dollar spot, but y'all know like bullseyes playground or whatever it's called. And one can of Play-Doh for her as well. These were 50 cents each at Walmart. So that is everything. Let me flip that's all everything out. that they are getting in their stockings this year. I hope those were some good ideas for you. If you would like to leave me a comment down below, let me know how old are your kids? What are you getting in their stockings? Do you have any fun stocking traditions? Um, do you have any other traditions if you don't celebrate Christmas? Um, what you like to do? Um, I'm always loving to hear what y'all are doing in your lives and how you're doing. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that, th that thumbs up. If you're brand new, please subscribe. There are lots more videos to come. And leave me a comment down below letting me know that you're new here and I would love to talk to you down in the comments. So until next time, that's where I'll see you. Bye-bye.